to get in my Uber to go to the airport to go to Japan for the very first time. And I don't have a lot of time to talk right now, but I will tell you a little more about it later. I'm excited. I gotta get all my luggage outside. I'm very tired. I did not want to wake up at 6 a.m., but I'm assuming it's gonna be worth it. And this lighting is awful because it's not even like light out yet. All right, I'm gonna go to the airport now. Here I am getting all comfy on the plane. This flight was like 12 hours, but it didn't feel that long because I watched a couple movies, listened to music, and had a couple of meals. So it was a pretty enjoyable flight. Oh my gosh, we're about to land and now I'm in Japan. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, here's some airport footage. Here's me being awkward on the train to Asakusa. Um, people are really quiet here, so shh. And it's a really pretty sunset that I was enjoying. I started to feel the sleep deprivation in my right eye. That's why I'm touching it, but I was okay and I was in a taxi cab going to my hotel. It was weird that they drive on the opposite side of the road and sit in the right side of the car, but it's okay, I got used to it. Hi guys, I'm officially in Japan in my hotel room. I really need to take a shower because I, I smell bad. I've been sitting in my own sweat for like 12 hours or more than that actually, so. I also feel like I can't be very loud because in Japan, the culture is very quiet. So I don't want to disturb the peace. I'm about to shower, put some new clothes on, and then get some dinner and explore a little bit for the first night and then go to sleep because technically it is bedtime for me right now. When in Tokyo, right? Okay, so I'll be back when I'm all ready. Yay, I'm all clean and dressed. I'm very bare bones right now because it's technically, like I said, bedtime for me and we're just going out to get food. But I wanted to show you my room before I head out. To so this room is kind of small, but it's really cute. It has two beds and I already like exploded my stuff everywhere. It has everything that I need, even another bed. And the bathroom is really cool. Look at that, it's like you step up into the bathroom. Honestly, if I was a lot taller, this bathroom wouldn't work for me, but thank God I'm I'm a little tiny gal. And they even provided razors, toothbrushes, hairbrush, a body towel, and cotton set. How awesome is that? And then, yeah, their shower's really nice. And their shampoo and conditioner and body wash. Smell really good. Wait a minute, there is a bidet this toilet. I'm gonna have a clean bum. Yeah. Footage of that out and about. <laughs> oh, I've seen this store at home. Yeah, this is <laughs> That's where I was planning on getting like a jacket. Yeah. Ferret yeah. fish. <laughs> He's like waiting. He wants to get in. Like, hey, Look at that guy. <laughs> Going to an all you can eat place. That's the ordering system, is a computer. <laughs> oh, wow. That's cool. We have some potato salad, which has an egg on it, and I immediately just wanted to pop it. But we have to get it on camera, so. Ready? This one already. Oh yeah, oh my gosh. <laughs> that looks so good. This is juicy. I love it. <laughs> I am the least peaceful person here. Just attacking you. I'm a Taurus. I wonder oh, what that means. You're an earth sign and I'm an earth sign. Uh, so oh. that means we're not like... That's why we... Yeah, <laughs>
it's too fluffy. And I didn't want to bring it on the plane. It's like insanely fluffy. This is a medium. Looks like it fits me. It is surprisingly warm. I can already feel the warmth inside. <laughs> so we're gonna get it. So in the last clip, it looks like I was buying a different coat, but I ended up getting this bad boy. For how much? Can you guess? Mm -mm. Nope, not a hundred dollars. Thirty-six eighty-nine, and it has this hood. So I look like I belong in Alaska. We're going to the temple. Wait, is that is that the temple? <laughs> it's right there. Let's go. So cr I'm not used to it being so quiet. <laughs> This is a good shot. Wow. Okay. I'm at the end of day one and I'm wearing these pajamas that were placed on my bed. I've never had a hotel provide me with pajamas. The top's a little big, but the bottoms fit pretty well. We'll see if they stay on all night because I usually get hot but I am so excited to sleep and for what tomorrow holds. Thank you for sticking along or tagging along for day one and I'll see you in the morning. Good morning. I am out and about. I don't know why I just sounded like a Canadian, but I am wearing a Canadian tuxedo today. Out and about, eating some breakfast and maybe not coffee for me, because I don't drink coffee, but maybe something, tea or something good. I went to bed at 9.30, <laughs> but still slept in, of course, because that's just how I am. I like to sleep. Okay. Bye. We're going to Pint Sauna Reset. Is there a sauna in there? Damn it. That's not where we're going. Oh. We're going to, uh, <laughs> that's embarrassing. <laughs> Why did I think it was that? Okay, so we're, never mind. We're going to, how do you say it? Fuglin Asakusa. You're vlogging me of me. I'm vlog you're vlogging me of me vlogging. That's meta. This is it? Yeah. Oh, it says push. I almost pulled. Watch your step. <laughs> Waffles with avocado, goat cheese, an egg, and tomato paste. I'm gonna get really close and show you how close I can get. <laughs> and then it's a plain waffle with syrup, right? Honey. Honey. That sounds pretty good. I'll give this breakfast a 9 out of 10 because it's hard for me to give a 10 out of 10. But yeah, that was really good. I've never had a waffle that's more savory. I've only had waffles with like syrup and like strawberries and cream and stuff. It was nice to try something different. And I think the plan for today is to do some shopping. I honestly want to see what I can buy in Japan for $100. Oh, We're here wow. during the day now a lot different during the day than it is at night. <laughs> yeah. You can actually hear a little more noise. <laughs> yep.
the hustle and bustle of the temple. I guess glazed strawberries are popular, so we're gonna try one. I'm trying a mochi, it has red beans inside, and a strawberry. And this is unlike anything I've ever had. I don't really know how to go about this, but... Mm, the strawberry really adds something to it. And I like the texture of the mochi. I don't really know. I've never had red beans before, but I don't have any complaints about it, so it's yummy. <laughs> It's funny. That guy with the big chin. I'm smiling under my mask. This hand sanitizer has a raccoon on it. It's insane. Oh, someone pooped. <laughs> I've never seen anything like that. Godzilla! I love that movie. Shopping. I'm going a little crazy. Oh, that's cute too. It kind of looks like this. It's very like grandma style, which I think is in right now. <laughs> Beef? No, I didn't think so. And onions and mushrooms. And scallops. Freezing cold and then I was like, oh nice, I get to put my hands into like a warm dryer and then then it was blowing cold air onto my freezing hands. So as you can see they're red at the fingertips, which I've never seen that before. And then pale on my palms. <laughs> Woo! Gotta take care of those hands with lotion. First, I put hand sanitizer on. And freezing! Huh. <laughs> Hello, this is Darma Jones reporting live from the Dog Cafe. This is uh, my first time being in a dog cafe and looks like the dogs are pretty cute so let's check it out. These are all the dogs. <laughs> Shiva wearing a sweater. <laughs> Hello. I have a friend. Oh, oh my gosh, look at all the dachshunds. This is making me want to get a dog. They like you. I'm a dog whisperer. I think we're gonna need to start feeding somewhere else. They're gonna 
oh. not want to be around us. Should I start feeding this one? Sure. What would you like? Or you're just going to eat the wood? <laughs> okay. Do you like a little chicken? 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 Mm. He did good job. <laughs> you get chicken. Are you guys nice? You're not going to fight each other? dog cafe an 8 out of 10 because all the dogs attacked me and one dog bit me but other than that they're really cute and I think the experience would be a little better if there wasn't food involved because I think dogs get a little crazy with food but that was really fun I love dogs and they're really they're fluffy and cute so I'm happy Bad one. Oh. Second attempt. We're gonna try this and actually do this one this time. The sea or the otter. Okay. Insert your coin and press this. And oh. that's sad. Uh, pull it forward. Forward like that? Yeah. That looks good. Wait a minute. Oh! Don't drop it, 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 don't drop it. Oh my god! Yes! Ah! I got one! Thank you. Thank you for believing in me. It's so soft! I'm gonna put it in this bag. Yay! Thank you, God. How's your day so far? Good. We've done a lot of things. <laughs> I I won an otter. You probably already saw that in the video, but it's very soft. Oh, a new a new thing that happened. I got an disposable camera, and I'm going to be taking random photos, and I'm, I'm going to develop them and put them in like a either a scrapbook or make a collage. So I'm excited. I haven't used one of these things in a really long time. I'm a crazy raccoon. <laughs> we went to a place called At Home Cafe where the gals wear maid costumes and we weren't allowed to get any footage inside because they didn't want us to get any videos of the girls but insert picture here and we had a cute little puppy poodle pancake and it was really yummy. <laughs> mm -hmm. 